with that, let's also move on and bring you an exclusive conversation now. My colleague Shivani spoke with K.M. Birla, chairman of Aditya Birla Group, on the sidelines of the IMA Awards and began by asking him how he really sees India positioned amidst this big global uncertainty that we've all been talking about and the outlook for FY24. Listen in. Well, I think we'll continue as a country on our path of growth, uh, which has been very steady in a world of great turmoil and more uncertainty than I've seen in the last 25 years. So I think that's uh, a huge positive for India. And I think uh, as someone from industry, and all of us from industry, I'm sure, feel uh, very proud about it. Sir, can you speak a little about the 5G rollout? How is that proceeding? 5G rollout is, uh, will begin soon. Nothing else, sir. I think we're talking about awards today, no business, so let's leave it at that. Okay, sir, any headwinds that you Vivo? see impacting the, uh, the Indian Vivo? businesses and the industry, as in the oil prices we have seen as a concern, what are the other headwinds that you see as challenge to the Indian economy? So I don't see oil prices as a headwind. I think that, you know, commodity cyclicality has always been the case. Uh, and as India's Indian business, I think that uh, we've learned to live with cyclicality and uh, Indian business is truly world class and of world quality in every every way. Um, I wouldn't say that that's a major, uh, that, that that isn't a bend in the road, if I can say that. Sir, last question. The finance minister in USA has said that India will be pivotal uh, in the value chain, global value chain. What do you have to think about? Sir? I think so. I think the uh, China plus one theory is playing out uh, in India's favor. Very much so. That's a fact. A lot of people who uh, are now wanting to be in India, invest in India and in the India growth story. All right, that is the word coming in from Kumar Mangalam Birla. But with that, here